How was your ride home, Shangmania? Did you do your hamming? Yes, it will be Christmas in Japan. I'm kind of jealous. That sounds awesome. I hope... I heard, like, a Studio Ghibli park just opened. In Kyoto. This Saturday, it will be 7 o'clock. I try to keep my times the same. So, Wednesdays, 8 p.m. Um, and Saturdays, 7 p.m. We're going to be doing some humble hubbub on Saturday. That I need to post it, but next week is the last week of F1, so we'll be doing our F1 stream on the Friday next week. So, Friday week. <laughs> Have a good night, Orion Rogos. Good to see you. Hope everything's well on your end. Thanks for stopping in. Hey. Ooh, excuse me. I will try to stream aggressively, as aggressive as a banana can. Maybe we'll throw some peels on the ground. Slip up the aliens, you know. Thank you. Kitchen sink percent, Orion Row. <laughs> Where I made this up on the weekend. Uh, basically, you can only use one weapon per boss. And so, first boss I'm killing with homing, second will be laser or fire, third will be spread, fourth will be pea shooter, fifth will be whatever the opposite is here. So, whatever this is, we're doing, so we're doing flamethrower now. Oh wow, you can just rush through that, that's pretty cool. I didn't realize that you were so powerful. Yeah, that's what's happening. By the way, awesome contra run, best of Canada, right here in the banana suit. <laughs> we were discussing JD Silva and I, how there's so many Canadians. Because JD's Canadian, Archie's Canadian, um, Altros is Canadian, Slormer's Canadian. There was so much Canadian representation in Contra over the weekend. Turn on the Radiant F1 to simulate the banana peels. <laughs> Next Friday for sure. <laughs> I need to get rid of the homing. Oh my! Okay, well that's not how I envisioned getting rid of the homing, but that works too, I guess. That was hilarious. We were on the edge of our seat watching Contra kick butt. I appreciate you all so much stopping by for that. I know it wasn't a normal stream and that we couldn't chat like we normally chat, but it was great. It was great having everyone there to support. It really was. I screwed up. <laughs> Oops. It's fine. This is fine. <sighs> I'm doing an interlude from PB attempts to try to get a kitchen sink run in. Walter's already done it. I want us to get a leaderboard going, so I, I, I gotta get one in, too. 
We've almost completed two so far. You get the monitor tomorrow, but you have to wait till Sunday or Monday to set it up. Ooh, what happens on Sunday or Monday? The flamethrower freaked out here before. Look at it. Yeah, that's what happened. You gotta run, but you wanna say thank you for doing the show and tell about the Grizzled. You finally bought it and it's so sick. Oh, I'm so glad you like it. It's absolutely one of my favorite co-op games. It was good to see you. I hope to see you again soon. And, and take care until I see you next time. It makes me happy that you like it. It's like a deeply moving game for a board game. It really is. You have to sign for the package and immediately after you sign for it, you need to drive to Texas for work to replace another guy who can't travel to Florida because of the hurricane. Ah, oh, that's a bummer. Good that you can help out though, really. Oh no! Well. Good thing I don't need to keep them both. weird with different weapons right yeah that's why one of the reasons why i wanted to do it orion rogue is just to kind of like shake things up i was telling everyone earlier like i i thought of this on the weekend just to you know be silly and then walter did a run and so now i need to do a run too but it's also like a way to mentally take a break from the grind we were so we've been so close and we've worked so hard so it's nice to shake it up every once in a while I was kind of having a rough day. For this one, we're going to do Pea Shooter. And then, oh crap, does anyone remember what I did two with? Did I do two with flamethrower or laser? I did it with flamethrower, right? Oh crap, I don't remember. <laughs> I think I did it with flamethrower. Yeah, I think it was flamethrower. If anyone wants to correct me, I'm, I'm happy to be corrected. Yeah, and the weapons, it doesn't matter what you use as long as you're not fighting it for the boss. Mini bosses are also fine, but for the boss, you have to use the correct weapon. I zoned out too, Justified. I'm pretty sure I used Flamethrower. I'm almost certain it was Flamethrower.
Holy jeez, it takes forever to die. Oh, thank you. Thanks so much, Justify. I appreciate that. Okay, good. So we've got the laser already, so that's important. So that means I don't have to pick up another one, but we might. I might just do it just for safety. Ah, uh, maybe not. Maybe I'll just go. I'll just go. surprised okay 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 I'm getting excited now I'm gonna stand here and I'm just gonna grab it and I'm going to switch to spread, and we're just going to go through here with spread. so much faster on normal I'm not even used to it holy crap okay hey MRP how's it going do you like it it's a full onesie believe it or not a full onesie for the troll one cycle. Yeah, sub 14. <laughs> Thanks to the GG's mine. For um for Octazel Subtober, I had wear a onesie in a stream and uh I got a banana onesie. <laughs> It's a bit weird how the bosses take way longer to spawn and die than they take damage. Oh, especially in easy mode. <laughs> JD, thank you for the GGs. What would have been really funny if that was your record run in a banana? We're gonna try it now. I think everything... Oh, after he dies? I don't even know. I didn't even think about it justified. <laughs> That was great. All right, that was the uh, inaugural kitchen sink percent. <laughs> 